there is a popular saying that one of two people in this world wears glasses with lenses from Danyan. And I guess this is true. Right now I'm going to Danyan city, the city of glasses. I heard a lot about the city, so I'm very excited. You probably heard that in China, every city or every place is specialized in producing something or manufacturing something. Well, that's true. Right now, I'm in the city of glasses. You can also say China's capital of glasses, Danyang city. I just arrived to the train station and ready to go to the most interesting place in the city. Let's go. This is the international city of glasses. Danyang is a county-level city located in Jiangsu province on the southwest bank of the Yangtze River. I've always heard from everyone, if you want eyeglasses, just go to Danyang. Each building has four floors that's so big, more than 100 shops inside, so you don't know which way you want to go. The reason for me coming here is just I'm very curious that all of my friends and everyone I know, they just told me if you want to buy glasses, you just come to Danyang city. You will get the best glasses with the best prices. That's some pretty cool sunglasses. Oh, you see branded glasses. You can see kids collection. I'm just checking this information on the internet. It says Danyang. This city is the world's largest lens production base and the biggest eyeglass products distribution center in Asia. Wow. That reveals that the city produces more than 400 million pairs of lens each year. Almost about 50% of the global production and 80% of China's total production. I'm just doing some comparison on the internet and as you see here, all the brands you can find on the internet, but the prices are so different. For example, here if you buy something, if this glasses is uh, 500, so in this, in Dangyang, you can buy it cheaper 300 and it's still the same quality. I mean, the same, everything is the same. It's just the same brand. It's just cheaper. Any price is just cheaper three or 400 differences because uh, the production base is here. So that's why it's cheaper. Are you Danyang man? Yes, I'm Danyang man. Yes, I'm Danyang man. Yes, I'm Danyang man. Yes, I'm Danyang man. Oh, look at all this professional equipment. You can immediately test your eye degree and then buy in this shop. Just test, buy. Just now I bought this sunglasses. I just got my sunglasses and the good thing is you think it's just a sunglasses, but actually I let them change it to myopia glasses. I, what I mean is, uh, this lenses, you can fix it according to your eye degree. After finishing checking all these glasses in this international glasses city, I'm going to check this other places in the city. Let's see how it is. I decided to go to the park just nearby and I'm gonna ride a bike, an e-bike, just five minutes. And this e-bike is just shared e-bike. You can rent it, so that's pretty convenient. So you just scan. Hello. You must put the helmet in order to ride. Let's go. I arrived to Wanshan Gongyan. Looks so beautiful. Gonna head to that tower. You know, when you say park in every city in China, they are also clean. That's very impressive. That's the first impression you get. Wow, so beautiful. See, this tower even look more beautiful when you come closer. People are exercising. I 
I heard that here in the city there's a lot of night snacks called in Chinese Ye Shi. But I don't know, I'm ex just exploring. <laughs> Just now the shop owner gave me extra two pieces because he said I'm handsome. Wow. After a tiring day. I'm in the train now heading back to Nanjing. It was a wonderful experience here in Danyang. It filled out my curiosity. And it's so wonderful to see so much things in the city. Like the whole production of lenses and glasses here. I also went to the uh, parks around the city and also the night markets. So I guess next time I want some glasses, I will just come to Danya. And remember, maybe one of the glasses you are wearing came from Danya. See you. <laughs>